The tension between the weekend and the Recording Academy seemingly continues to heat up. According to interim um, Grammy chief Harvey Mason Jr., the After Hours artist, which is Weekend, has yet to be asked to be included in the lineup of the performers at the award-giving event, which is supposed to be held in March 2014, um, March 14, 2021. In an interview with uh, a, media, uh, a media outlet, Harvey was asked if The Weeknd, who was already snubbed at the award despite his successful Blinding Lights track, let me add that there, mm -hmm. would be more involved um, at the upcoming events. And uh, to that, Harvey responded, and I quote, not that I am aware of. Bear in mind that the Canadian hitmaker previously criticized the Recording Academy after he nabbed zero nods at the upcoming event despite his record-breaking and critically acclaimed album After Hours. So, what is going on? It's super here? crazy, you know, when um, you know you put in a lot of work in a, in, a, in a recording year and then you you get nominated for awards and your name doesn't come up. It can be really frustrating, and I know how that is. But there are also speculations that that's because he went to perform at the Super Bowl. But um, I think Harvey cleared the air on that when he mm -hmm. said that well, look. He uh, yeah, that the performance was way before the nomination started, so it has nothing to do with that. So I think it's okay for you to know that sometimes you're going to work twice as hard and still not be recognized for your hard work. And it's okay, it just prepares you for greatness. This guy has always got an award, he's always been nominated on year in, year out. So, you know, losing one year doesn't mean you're a failure. At least the world is enjoying the album, that's all that matters if you ask me. Okay, remember we talked about this last year? And we're I all know, last year. Sounds like ages ago. I know, ago. right? <laughs> <laughs> Remember when we talked about this last year, we both agree, like, with the amount of fan base that The Weeknd has, it's kind of impossible. It is and impossible. It does not make sense that he at was all. not nominated. I think we came to a conclusion, like, at the end of the day, the award does not determine you being this amazing person. Mm. They're not nominating you. It doesn't undermine that you're a great artist. Even for this award that just passed, the American Music Awards, mm. we could see that, okay, The Weeknd is great. But I think he was nominated. Yes, like seven even times. It, yes, and he won, I and he won two awards. And even performing a song, um, uh, what's the name of the song I love? Um, Save Your Tears. Right. Shows that The Weeknd is amazing. We were yeah. talking about him yesterday. Yeah. Like, it puts you through a journey. Yeah. It, everyone knows that The Weeknd is a legend and he's moving. Yeah. So he not being nominated for the Grammy doesn't undermine him or make him less than an artist. It does me. show that there is something going yeah, on is behind the scenes. I mean, we're well, not the stupid. Screen. There is politics and it exists in um, organizations. The reason why I wouldn't go completely with what Ife said was that the Grammys is supposed to be a reflection of what the people want. Okay. So it's to be weird. Like there's some organizations, like the Oscars, for example. The Oscars has a panel and they don't usually do, um, you know, votes. Okay. The panel would decide right. what oh. they want to do. And they have, the panel is supposed to consist of the best people, which is why we're all freaking out okay. when um, um, Genevieve was on the panel for Africa, something, something. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so that's a bit different, you know? Like, mm -hmm. okay, but if you claim that you're for the people, by the people, kind of like a democratic award, mm -hmm. and then the most streamed album or most, one of the most streamed whatever, whatever is not part of that, you know, it's a bit weird. Okay, we heard the story that you gave us or the excuse that you gave us for the... Um, nominations. We, mm -hmm. I didn't buy it, but sure. Now, lineup of performances. Are you telling me that there's nobody from the whole of last year who doesn't want to see the um, weekend. The weekend perform any of his songs? Are you? Are you like, after his amazing performance? You like, but but you guys need to know that um, nothing was going to change. Did you guys think that okay because they postponed it? Because we've had the same conversation before. Because they postponed the award, they are now going to put the weekend in it, or they are going to include him on, on the list of performances. I think we've been through this. So this is like crying over spilled milk, if you ask me. I mean, they should, well, the problem is why are they doing that? Mm -hmm. I mean, they give the people what they want. Um, I've been asking whatever. that question for months. We, we have, actually. We have. It means a continuation, but nobody knew for sure that he was not going to be on the lineup, especially because there was a movement with mm -hmm. that that you expect mm. him to be there. If it's not racism, it's definitely something. True. And it's not a good something, because if it's not based on what is important, which is his talent and the mm -hmm. fact that audience wants him. But let's go on a music break. I don't want to talk too much. It's still Friday. I'm sure everybody has plans.